Come here, girl. Come here, girl. This is Kelly, our brand new golden retriever puppy. She's seven and a half weeks old right now. She was born on December 21st. It is February 12th today. And this is her first time out in the snow yesterday, first time outside of her kennel away from her, away from her litter mates actually.
everybody welcome back to the cabin so that's Callie's first four years here uh, living this outdoor lifestyle with me starting from uh, when we got her as a pup and still lived in our uh, house in the village raising our our girls our two daughters ironically we actually bought Callie more for my wife so that she would have a companion while I was off doing my outdoor adventures and uh, took her out a few times and um, then got to the point where we just felt guilty leaving her at the house while I was out uh, enjoying out the outdoors and, and building the homestead, getting it started. So the first summer, she was rarely here at the cabin with me. And then it, um, as the, the homestead evolved, she started spending basically all of her time with me. And over that period of time, you could just see her becoming more and more wild and more um, sort of integrated into the natural environment, um, re uh, reverting back to her uh, canine instincts and being able to fully express them and it was fun it's been fun to watch it's been fun to see how she's <laughs> become less and less of a um, an intel and social creature to more of a uh, I would say um, more dedicated to just a couple of people my family mainly um, other than that like bringing her into town or taking her into a social situation or having visitors she's kind of dysfunctional she's just not very good at at socializing and it's mainly because her training has been more about just um, uh, learning or yeah I guess learning by being part of every situation so going everywhere with me and uh, you know never having a collar on never have never being on a leash she's horrible when you put her on a leash trying to walk her or take her to the bed or something she's just not used to that and does not like that um, restriction. And seeing her predator instinct to, to chase prey and to actually kill animals, like she actually catches mice and squirrels and chipmunks. And with small game, she'll actually attack that small game and uh, finish it off before bringing it to me. Instead, of course, she just picks it up and, and she actually, still fairly soft mouth, she'll actually bring um, a bird to me, a duck or a grouse, or you saw a squirrel in one of the videos. She'll actually bring it to me in good condition without being too hard mouth and then she'll easily give it up to me. But if it's still alive, she will finish it off. She'll shake it and kill it. So that uh, might be alarming to people that just watch and think she's so cute and animated, but she actually is becoming a wild animal. And uh, I'm glad to be able to provide that habitat, or provide this lifestyle for, for her to fully express that. It's interesting because she doesn't actually come from, a, she wasn't, um, bred for hunting. I think most of her um, ancestors have been more like uh, show quality or show show dogs. So to be to have this uh, predator instinct is just it's bred into the breed. Still being a golden retriever, it's bred for duck hunting, but um, a lot of them don't have that drive as like as much as she has. Anyway, a month from her fourth birthday, I just thought I'd share some some uh, footage of her growing up and uh, looking forward to seeing how she does over the next four years here at the homestead. So if you're new to the channel and you want to see more of the uh, of Callie living this uh, outdoor lifestyle with me, then you can click on uh, one of the videos or playlists in the corner of this, or you can subscribe by clicking on the icon. So thanks for watching. I appreciate it. And I look forward to seeing you back here at the cabin next time. Take care.